Hello everybody. It's time to continue the Metro Exodus. Alright, so if I remember correctly, last time I managed to get past the bridge. So, that's like two weeks ago, three weeks ago. And we're gonna continue from that. Level is spring. Left Volga behind. The endless expanses of Russia stretch before us now. The bridge dwellers had finally decided to believe that we were not demons and let us pass. Anna was right. We invaded their world, and it's not up to us to destroy it, no matter how stupid it may seem. Electricity is a sin. Is that really worse than the lies we were told in the metro? about how the whole world was dead and there was nowhere to go? Everybody in the tunnels bought that convenient lie. Once we reach Yamantau, we will at least know if that lie was justified, since so far we haven't met any signs of enemy occupation. Alright, so I remember this. Basically, we are on the train, this radio, some of my weapons. Um, what was I supposed to do? So, let's take a look at this. Weapons. His name is Idiot. All right, let's go explore. Now we can turn off the line. Actually, did I check the radio already? Azamat, come in! More hold here! Do you read me? Over! Azamat, come in please! Over! Salam, Warhol. Reading you loud and clear. What's your problem? Crying all over the air like that. Over. Finally. Nobody can hear me. That's my problem. Ah, that. Yeah, that happens. I thought there was something going on. How are you doing, anyway? Over. Well, everything is fine, actually. Family life, you know. <laughs> Why do you sound so bored in that case? Are you feeling adventurous? Yeah, just a bit. What's the hold up then? Come over here, old Sabertooth misses you. There's also something brewing here, so your help would be kinda welcome. So just come over. You copy? Over. Copy that. I like the idea. We'll start packing tonight, and get back to you once we're ready to move out. Is that okay? Over. Ah, that's my man. <laughs> we'll be expecting you soon then. Over and out. Give the old Sabertooth my regards. Over and out. Why are you guys 
is kissing Munchakov's ass so much? How long has it been since he even arrived in Irkutsk? Not even two years. You better reconsider your position on Meshnikov. Did you forget who started trading with the convicts from Zolotoy? Huh? Well, that was Zakhar's idea. And Zakhar is the man. He crossed by cow. Alone. We'd sign or do anything he proposes at once. Well, Menshikov, I couldn't care less about. Aren't you getting too big in your head? You're so cool now that the relay gang is off your case? Don't fall off that high horse. Go to hell, Dan. <laughs> All right. I can live with listening to Menshikov if you're so fond of him. Ah, enough of that shit already. The important part is that your coot is still around, and you guys are too. You're right. That is the important part. Well, give my regards to Menshikov. <laughs> Over and out. You devil. <laughs> Over and out. And some radios are playing music. Alright, we're done. Special Restoration Committee speaking from the Ark Project base. Everyone Arc who can Project. hear me, everyone still loyal to the gods. Proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code 1811-79. Area 18-5. I repeat, proceed to the rally point. Rally point location is code 18-1-1-79. One one. One one Area 18-5. Only by standing together shall we overcome any and all obstacles. Okay, we have to keep that in mind. Maybe it's something we can use later. How do I exit? Oh. Alright, I think we are ready to go look around. Should we talk to her first? It's like living in a fairy tale. A prince has rescued his princess from a monster-infested dungeon and is taking her to his magic kingdom where they are going to live happily ever after. Do you think we're going to find that kingdom in the end? Though, if it's with you, I'll be fine anywhere. <coughs> live happily ever after is the most important part as far as I'm concerned. The same animation all over and over again. Leaving already? Well, go get them, Tiger. for a king, I must say. Well, what do you think of this workbench, eh? 
Everything is within reach, yet there's so much space left. Most of the stuff you and the guys found outside and gave to me went into making this workshop happen. So thank you. We'll have to keep pitching in like this too. Looks like we're facing a long journey, and useful things like ammo or equipment don't grow on trees. Plus, the further from Moscow we get, the harder they'll probably be to get. So don't forget to collect all the materials you find to keep us going. There's so many things to do. I haven't decided where I'm going to work on the suits, but I'll have to, and soon. And it's high time we fixed our uniforms. Some of our people are starting to look pretty ragged, you know. Indeed. Well, plate carrier won't hold the back plate anymore, and he jokes that he's lucky it's not the front one, or else his toes would be in danger. <sighs> Regardless, I am turning this little gang back into a real army. Well, that's it. I bragged enough and won't waste any more of your time. The Colonel summoned you. Well, I have stuff to do too. You guys are fast to break gear, but none too expedient to fix it. Uncle Tokarev! Uncle Tokarev! <sighs> What oh, a smoke break. That's good. <laughs> oh, this is one mean smoke. Damn, this is rough. <laughs> well, <clears throat> nothing we couldn't take. <clears throat> well... You are the right kind of guys. I mean, you, the colonel, duke, that guy did a swell job on that bridge. And now he's bragging about it like a child. He's a child, really, no, a child, but he's good. So, uh, yeah, what did I want to say? Uh, yes, uh, thank you. you. You people accepted me and, and I, uh, I'm a simple guy. I, I, I will pay the debt back, okay? No, I don't. So, but how, how do you like it out here after your tunnels? Freedom, like huh? Everyone else, All right, let's check that. And a needle, and I use a sail stitch. Anything new? Whoa, cool! Can you teach me? I sure can, but later. Nothing new. I've got work to do. Uh, compass Will you let or me fix the metal detector. Strap? Well. Sure thing. Let's keep the compass for oh, now. But under supervision. Sam is so strict, you know. Hurra! And Uncle Sam isn't strict at all. He's kind. <laughs> Alright, look here. Everything I'll is in top co condition. Now we do so. this. Let's go yes. to talk tip there. You have got to be careful here. You know. Got that. Why cannot I see my knots? Oh, journal is tab. Don't rush it. Uh, journal is tab. Maybe I can read the notes at, um, yes. in So here. you're back. What other plans does our leader have in store? Wait, don't tell me. Right, it's, it's too dark. So I don't see any new notes. Alright, let's go talk to the the leader. Oh I can play guitar. Arjo, come on in and have a seat. Stepan's putting on a live performance here. So, Artyom, are you up for a jam? 
Come on, pick the guitar up. I already have it. That's pretty cool. I'm sorry to ask, Katya, but Nastya's father. He's dead, isn't he? Does Nastya know? Stop it already! <laughs> well, what did you ask? Hey, the colonel's <laughs> waiting for you on the bridge. So, what's up with your plate carrier? Tokarev was mad. Ah, uh, it's a long story. You have to drink. Come on, out with it! Well, there I am, sitting on a beam, looking at Artyom, milling about below. Oh, you are so full of it! <laughs> Artyom did most of the work! <laughs> <laughs> that he did, uh, yeah, he did. But you don't have to interrupt my lies. You ask me about the Vest yourselves. Alright, go on. So, I see Artyom get to the door, and I think it's time I came down. So I do. But something just holds on to me. What does? How should I know? It's dark. Nobody around. But I can't move. And those locals kept going on about Tsar something. So I thought I was in a kind of a bind. So? So I just unfastened the safety and let down. There was that shed down there. The roof was uh, kind of close. Uh, 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 and what about the Tsar? Oh, blue! The Tsar was huge! Scary as shit! And there was this rusty bolt, and my carrier got snagged on it. <laughs> well, you, Duke, are lucky you already have a nickname. <laughs> Oh, there's a shower. That's hilarious. And what was this that? a shower? Oh, <laughs> next. Next we jumped that old preacher of theirs. Well, Artyom did most of it. <laughs> Alright, keep telling. He swooped in like a hawk! Keep telling the story. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's good. Well, I was clamoring about those beams and fighting that side. Here, Artyom. <laughs> oh, I'm killing myself. Listen. I had a talk with the Ark! All thanks to Tokarev, he got the decoder working. Ark, come in. Come in, Ark. Over. Hey, this is Ark? Hey, uh, identify yourself. Uh, over. This is Colonel Svetoslav Milnikov speaking. I'm in command of a special operations force. We have received <laughs> your signal and are currently heading your way. Do you copy? Over. Yes. Yes, uh, hear you loud and clear. Who am I talking to? Uh, how do I address you? The Deputy Chief of Communications Department, Major Ivanov. A, a moment. Oh, yes, Major. I understand that the checkup is in order. Great, Colonel. Um, Emelikov? Simply capital. I am sorry for the lack of trust, but as you know, the situation is dire, and the enemy is always ready to strike. I do understand, Major, and I hope that you can tell the leadership that my people are true to their duty and will be at their full disposal as soon as we arrive. Over. Thank you for the great news. How large is your force, Colonel? I have a squad of the best operatives the Special Forces have to offer. A squad? Ah, uh, I see. I feel like they're great. enemies. Great! Yes, uh, we aren't a large force, but we bring a message of extreme importance. We are heading towards you from Sector K6 Alpha. Do you have any data on enemy forces we might encounter on the way? No. 
Just a moment, I have to check. Uh, K6, uh, Alpha, you say? Uh, as far as I can see, there have been no enemy encounters ever reported in the area, Colonel. I regret. I must end our conversation here, but know that we are waiting for your arrival. I am making my report immediately, and I am sure the Minister of Defense will be eager to see you. This is a great honor! Thank you! Just a few words more, though. Uh, what is the general situation there, Major? Please. Uh, Colonel, sir, you do understand this is classified information. Uh, but I do understand you. We are doing fine. Do not worry. Uh, well, see you in the Ark. Over and out. I serve the people. Over and out. So, do you get this now, you doubting Thomas? <laughs> I'm so excited, my hands are still shaking! Oh, the minister himself! This is incredible! By the way, like Arthur, it's you should take a look at the map. As you can see, we're heading almost straight for the Yamantal complex. Katya and Kress tell me that the line there is in decent condition. Uh, surprising, really. Taking into account the number of priority targets there. What? We are approaching the Yamantau bunker. The final destination of our long journey. Direct radio contact with the bunker has completely dissolved Miller's resentment towards me for destroying our previous lives. He is eagerly anticipating the meeting with the Minister of Defense he was promised. Probably such things are important for a career officer. The people, though, are less interested. They are asking important questions. Where are the occupying forces? Why is there just wilderness and people gone wild around? What's stopping the government from restoring the country? What was being done in the last 20 years? Miller believes that we'll get all the answers. He will be pardoned, as well as Anna and I. And we will all return home to the Metro. A rail car going ahead of believe this. We're there. Do you get this? We're finally there. This has been our goal, not for weeks or months, but for 20 years. My whole life. And it was not spent in vain. Now I know it for a fact. Mama, look. Are we going to live here now? I don't know. Why? I don't like this place. It's creepy. Don't say that. Over, Colonel. It's getting really hot out here. Everyone, masks on. Passengers, get inside and button up tight. Yes, of course. Come on, Nastya. Change of plans. We're taking the rail car from here. Wait for our human me. <sighs> How about me? You've been dreaming to get here for so long, and are now leaving me behind? <laughs> Am I your daughter or not? All right, come with us. Or else I'll never hear the end of it. A wise decision. Yermak, stop the engine. to the safe zone, and sit tight there. We do that right now! Stepan, you're in charge while I'm away. Sir, yes sir! Great, let's go! Damn, they've been pounding this place. Where's the Moscow? Yeah, looks like it. C-4, 
see that crater? Wonder what the yield was on that one. Looks like a hundred to me. Rocky. Your guys used to have three and five hundred ones too. Well, even a hundred seems to have done okay. <laughs> We're going into tunnels, I guess. This way. Look at all those cars. Artyom was right. People were coming here from all over the country. Yes, they were. Nobody came from Moscow, though. Until now. So much time wasted. We'll make up for that now. Well, we're almost there. So many cars. Oh, no, 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 I don't know what to Look, this, this is a bad place. Now, we shouldn't have come here. Really? Okay, so where's my welcoming committee in red carpet? I don't get this. Oh, see? Nobody home. How about we go back? Huh? Поехали. Look! The weapon. Identify yourself. Colonel Miller, here to report to the Minister of Defense. And where are your people, Colonel? With the train. It's dangerous outside. Contact them and tell them to take the train into the main airlock for decontamination. Welcome to the Ark, Colonel. Proceed through the tunnel and take the elevator. You'll be met inside. I don't trust him. See? I think there's We're something expected. wrong. like going on the ground, but this place, well, this is completely creeping me up. Why is it so deserted here? <coughs> no gun placements, no patrols, not even lookouts. Why would they need any of that? A nuclear warhead couldn't take it out. What are the maintenance people thinking, I wonder? Yeah, this place could use some cleaning, at the very least. Sam, idiot, you know what? No need for us all to crowd the government, so you two better stay with Crest. Yes, sir, sir, yes, sir. Prepare a speech. Reporting to the minister is no joke. I kind of need some Get weapon that case. is very strong, close range. <laughs> Don't you feel like you should say something to Artyom now? Yes, you were right, Artyom, and I was wrong. Thanks for not giving up. Nothing. I think there will be notches. They look like notches. Comrade Minister, Commander of the Joint Special Operations Forces, Squadron of the City of Moscow, Colonel Miller, reporting. I would like to request that my people are provided with temporary quarters and supplies, as there are women and children among us. Still, our fighters are in top shape and ready for action. Women and children? <laughs> Good. Haven't had those in a while. Who are you? Hot 
is going as planned. Everyone is fine. So far. So far? <coughs> I, I demand a, a meeting with the Minister of Defense. Now! Do not worry. Everything will be just fine. And even better. The Minister and the Chief himself are expecting you for dinner. Dinner? What the hell? Are you fucking mocking me? Maybe there are the carnivals. Where is the government answer? All here, Colonel. All here. We are the government you people deserve. Don't you dare, you carnivals! Yeah. You're just, you're just fucking cannibals. Calm down, we'll get John this like this. And believe me, nobody likes that bitter taste. The girl will have to wait though. We must run the tests first. I don't like that cough of hers. Untie my hands, you motherfucker. And I'll shove those tests so far up your ass, you'll be spitting Watch them. your tone, young lady. Do as that young man does. He woke up long ago, but quietly listens to wise people talk. You fucker! Let me... Let me go! You scum! Not one will escape! Not a single! So, Colonel, now you will pick up the radio and tell the rest of your people on the train to come here. If you don't want her to suffer for a really long time before she is served. Do you understand? And here I was hoping for an intelligent conversation for a change. Alas. That's not a problem, though. Since this nice young man will surely do it instead. He won't dare be contradictory once we're done with you. Well, nice meeting you and all. Yakov, you may start. I'll get you even after I'm dead. That may well happen, Colonel. I could choke on you or something. In the meantime, I'll you excuse beasts. myself. Come here! I'll rip you all apart! Every last one of you should have done that before the war! Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Long time. Oh, a long time! Oh, a long time since the war! Oh, I friend, I will be fooled again! Good. <laughs> Nice. Artyom! Remains! Here. Colonel, sir. I think that's Thank enough. You, son. But it is not. We have to get them. But first, we must find Anna. I'm sorry. I went too far with that elevator. To hell with it! Idiot! Start the main elevator up! Daddy! Elevator on the move! Sam! EDA, we need the cover! Yes, sir! Well done! We can hold out for that long! Where did they come from?
Can I throw something? I, I don't like the scope, like I have... I don't have ammo. Just like our old D6. Even the lift is the same, exactly. True, and quite fortunate. This way, we can hope to find Anna. Still, the complex is huge, and we have 10 minutes at the most. So, we'll have to split. Hi, Mike. Yeah, so, I had a good Christmas. How about you? Room, the generator hall and the storage. Idiot, you come with me to the command center. Artyom, you take the barracks and the sick bay. Okay, barracks and the sick bay. Let's go! Your floor, Artyom. Oh. I really need to change my weaponry, like I need something close range. Can I change it here? How do I change my weapons? I forgot. Controls. Back, back, halt is edge. All right, so can I take off the scope from this one? The scope is actually not helping. Maybe a reflex sight would be best. Suppressor. Hmm. Should I make this a silent weapon? It's not as accurate. But I already have a silent weapon. This one has most damage. Okay, this is a no-brainer. Maybe add more magazine actually. So I don't have to reload as often. Should I even keep red laser? Let's see how it looks without the red laser. No, I don't think I need the laser. This would be fine. So, in that case, this can be my long range weapon. The sniper. Maybe not make it silent one. Little bit more damage, more ac accuracy. Biggest magazine. Okay, keep that. Keep that. No need for red laser. This is like my silent. For this one, I would like to have a scope. Okay. 
79 ammo. Five drawing knives. Alright, we need more ammo for the main weapon, this one. But for now I will keep this. That's my main weapon. Use reflex with suppressor for which weapon? You mean for the rifle? This AK reflex. Maybe suppressor would be good, like cross range, but I lose accuracy and I lose a lot of damage. That's the problem. I don't want to lose damage. I want to have maximum damage, I just want to be able to, if I go into a firefight, I need to be able to see what I'm shooting, close range, so this is, I think this is the best way, reflex, long barrel, if I need to snipe something, I can use this one, and if I need to be silent and go around, I can use this one. How did the map look like? We're gonna just go straight, I guess. Okay, they're torturing some somebody. Just a light or what? How do I open the door? The door didn't open. Also, how do I throw stuff? Okay, that's the button. Just in case I need to throw something. I even have a molotov. Let's keep the knife. Oh, I even have a grenade. Let's keep the knife. So I guess I have to... Turn on the power here. I really need a scope for this weapon, because this is like my long range silent weapon. Thing is, I don't really need a silent weapon here. So who was over here? He's gone.
Did I just switch the weapon accidentally? Second count. I'm moving up slowly. Wait. Okay, better reload this one. Okay, now I have a full magazine. Some kind of freezer. <laughs> 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 Crap. 
Great. Yeah, I didn't know I would die if I go there. So... So I guess that's supposed to be like a warning that I... I'm not supposed to go there. But they can run across. Body just dropped there. I can go across here. This was just like a secret area. I need to go back. Can't go anywhere from here. So how am I supposed to get across here? up here. Why did you shoot there? What the fuck? But there was meat. Meat, you see? <laughs> you can kill me too like this. Ammo is fine. This map is not really telling me anything. Guys are crazy. Okay, I'm getting uh, lots of scopes. I hope I find. Actually, 
I don't need to use the ammo table or the weapon table if I just change the scopes and stuff. Let's see what new do we have. Okay, we have a night vision scope. That's interesting. Infrared laser. Only detectable with night vision scope. That's cool. So let's try that. So now we have a red laser with the night vision. I don't even need the night vision scope, I think. I can just use my night vision goggles. Okay, the scope is quite uh, restrictive. But what if I use night vision goggles? Yeah, I can see the the, the dot. So I can switch to night vision whenever I need to. So I don't need the scope. Let's get rid of the night vision scope. That's so weak. That's it, uh, thanks. I thought I hit them, but somehow it seemed I didn't hit them. Here or up here. There, mate. Ah! He's up there. Look. It was just me. Not me. Yes, the fool has arrived. Now, what kind of situation? Or the road is break. No sign of Anna. Copy that.
Okay, how much ammo do I have? 27 for this. 55 plus 6. One third. For, I have lots of ammo for this weapon. I might as well use it as my main. Where am I supposed to go now? Here. Up here. <laughs> Shit. I need to char recharge my batteries. Yeah, I don't really like the night vision, like it ruins the atmosphere. So I'm not gonna use it. So I came from there. There's a door, I won't be able to open this. I can go up here. Maybe I should try the shotgun as a close range weapon. Like this is a decent, actually this is a decent close range. This is my snipe. Okay. I don't need the shotgun. Can I go across the pipe? I was here already. They should have. Did I miss anything? I don't think so.
the sword. Finally. How do I kill these people? With the armor. I wasted so much ammo on him. Another one. I think I just headshot at him. The Molotov is pretty effective. I should be using that more. How many do I have? I have three left. Wow. We're in a torture chamber. Maybe we will read the notes later. I'm not gonna read them right now. I'm gonna maybe do another gameplay, game through, play through, with um, music off, to keep it more immersive. Like, if I played it like this. It would be more realistic, maybe. Maybe I will keep the music off right now. But I also want to experience it the way they meant it to be experienced. With the music. Actually, I will keep the music off. I want to real realistic experience. It's more immersive. Without any music. There she is. Artyom, I knew behind you. There is always one like you. A hero! You're not saving anyone! Just like the others! So just... Freeze! Yes, yes! Then Let just, him just go! Don't kill me! Now! Uh, remember what I told you! There was an ex... Enough chatter! Oh. 
Are you all right, Artyom? Thank God. Let's report to the Colonel. Dad, it's me. Anna, are you okay? Where are you? In the sick bay. Artyom found me. Too fast, though. I need to catch my breath a bit. This whole situation, though. I thought we wouldn't see anything worse than that cult on the Volga. And that's Silentius with his damned fanatics. <sighs> but no, it appears there was still space for growth. We could have gotten killed there. We almost got eaten here. That bastard. Unbelievable. To think he used to be a doctor. Don't matter. We'll see what happens now. We did survive him, after all. in Moscow. Those keep people on the ground with their deceit. But these... All right, but what do we do I'll now? damned if I know, Anna. No idea. Have you found anything, idiot? Their defense sites, HQs... All the information is outdated. All links are long gone. Still, the ones that light up worked for at least a few years after the war. What's down there? It's Caspian One, a comm center. There's one more just like that in Novosibirsk. <coughs> Are you going to drag us to some other bunker I don't now? No, Anna. We have to make the decision together. Did you get everything you could, idiot? We're leaving. One moment. I'll finish breaking everything here. Come on, come on. Okay, all done. I don't think you should have put it like that, Anna. It all worked out this time, didn't it? It worked out. It really did. My concern is what if next time it doesn't? You're right, of course. But do you intend to live forever? <laughs> of course not. All the more reason to strive and spend more time of what is allotted to me with that guy over there. I've grown attached to him.
Get in, everybody! Sam, enough, get in! I just wanted to fix Completely over. Time to go find the real government bunker, I guess. Few hours later. Oh, to think I believed those pricks from Hansa. I believed that Moscow was controlled by the HQ. That we were under occupation. That we were still in war. That there were generals here giving orders. What an idiot, Suka! I will repeat my question. What do we do now? Could we go back to Moscow? Tell them the truth about the war, the government. They'll shoot us on approach. And even if we do break through, what can we do against Hansa? Who'd believe us with no proof? <laughs> what about going back to Volga? We could live there. What do we do about the locals? They weren't exactly happy to see us there. Do we kill them all? Is anybody here up for that? Back in Moscow, Artyom had been dreaming of finding a habitable place and building a colony there. Isn't it time we got to it? The idea is good, but how do we find the place? Just keep traveling? The Aurora needs an overhaul. <coughs> what do we do if it breaks down? Satellites. What satellites? You want to leave the fucking planet? There's a satellite communication center on the Caspian Sea. It survived the war. Oh. And if we gain access to the data collected by the satellites... We won't have to travel randomly. Radiation level maps, even your regular satellite photos could really help us out here. That's an idea. What if there is something worse than cannibals there? Could well be. But first, we're going to be really careful this time. And second, does anyone have any better ideas? I don't. Well, I guess we've got ourselves a new plan. Artyom, shall we look for that place you wanted? Sound the horn, then! <laughs> Three months on the road. Three months of constant trial. But, after Yamantau, we are ready for anything fate can throw at us. Mere kilometers separate us from the Caspian One communication center. Will the maps within yield a spot free from radiation where we could finally settle in peace? I don't know. But what's left for us but hope? The desert is taking its toll. The crew suffers from heat and thirst, and the Aurora is not in her top form. We're out of coal and had to switch to burning available fuel. Old cross ties and twigs. Maybe I can play the Caspian as well. Alright, completely different kind of place. Super hot, but it's like a, looks like a snow almost the sand. I'm not in love with this place. Nothing but sand and heat. I feel like shit here. Come on, man! 
Artyom, a car! <laughs> I don't like this welcome either. Let's go. They stopped in that village there. Looks like somebody lives here. I see. How are the men doing, Demir? Stepan is the worst off. The others are not so well either. Only us here are still in fighting shape. <sighs> Thank you. Ada, you and Demir reconnoitre the area. We need to find that damn bunker and hit the road as soon as we do. We might have a slight problem with hitting the road, Colonel. And there's barely enough water in the boiler to make some tea. And we're all out of coal. I see. We'll need to address that, too. Anna, Demir, one more task. Look for water and fuel. Well do. Get the men ready. We need to set up defenses. Roger that. See you soon. Just try to be careful, all right? Artyom. We have to learn who those men with the car are. They do look like regular bandits, but we can't take risks here. The car was headed for the village. Looks like they have a comms relay there, and it should hold some info, which is just what we need now. Move out as soon as you're ready. Crest, can your rail car pull the train? It might, but really Hi, slowly, and not for too long. The engine is too weak for the weight, and we, we don't have much diesel left. Clear! Artyom! I've got something for you. Are you going out? Look here, then. This is something I finished just now. All right. Hollowed out a couple of Tihar bullets and filled them with explosive. Some explosive ammo right there. Now, you can do it yourself. It's quite simple. Don't forget to clean your guns regularly, so with all the sand the around. Looks like it used to Open weapons inventory? What is that? Weapons inventory, hold I. The hull's a ticket office and lockers. Oh. Now. Could use some cleaning. I see there's a button like this. Oh, there's auto walk. Oh, and this is how to run. Now I got this web, this uh, run toggle and sprint toggle. This will turn on the run and keep it all the time. Let's turn, take them off. All right, so. so this is the weapons toggle, and here I can change the ammo. Do I need to press this? We need to change that. Keyboard, weapons, inventory. Okay, now it's incendiary. And how do I just reach that? Okay, that's pretty quick. Uh, I wanna check the weapons stuff. Okay, it's not available. 
Well, I hope my weapons are maintained. Mm. Mm. Artyom! <coughs> Wait, I'm coming with you. I think I could use a little walk right now. Stopa, you can hardly walk. You'd better rest while it's not your shift. Well, Artyom, I really do feel kind of under the weather now. Maybe next time. All right, let's go. You're right. Artyom and Demir are going out for a simple today. recon, not a fight. Okay, set up the perimeter. And what if you they get, get to the back the train. Idiot, you get the engine. Then they'll the retreat back to Car has entered the village for some reason. I have to find those people and obtain water for the crew with their help or without it. Let's try to go there with weapons down. Like, let's try to go there with uh, without killing anybody. I love just trying too hard. Is he overheating? Too much sun, perhaps? Is that the guy who's coming with me? We're all overheating here. I'll relieve him once we get step on here. Yeah, we'll handle that. Well, I'm off too. So, what direction am I gonna go? <clears throat> Over here, I think. I should have gone here. With this guy. Is this the guy who's going with me? Yes, a silencer. Do you see that building with the antenna? The car went that way. Be careful out there though. We don't know what to expect from the locals. Better switch to the silent weapon. Oh, it's this one. Use the normal ammo for now. Everything is loaded. Where's my main weapon? There's a sandstorm coming, I guess. I want to keep my weapon down just in case I can talk with these people. Okay, this made a big noise.
Seriously? I shouldn't use this weapon, to be honest. I should use this one. Not very effective. What if I use the incendiary ammo? It's more effective than that's what I will be using. What is this shrine? This one goes with one, one shot. Can't even go in from here, there. I don't have lots of ammo, so I don't know. Should I be wasting this? Why am I even in the ruins? Because it's full of this... These monsters. There's one sleeping. Let's try to sneak around. Save. They can attack me. Sandstorm is coming. It's safe. I really want to see if I can talk to these guys.
train has arrived. But this is where I'm supposed to go. Somebody is shooting up there. They may look like bandits, but they don't look necessarily bandits. So I'm kind of... Uh, <coughs> oh, it doesn't let me go. I really wanted to go talk to this guy. from outside I can climb up there oh no I'm back here is there like a zip line or something oh there's a line problem down here. How do I get up there? So there's a line from here to up. right place even. Yeah, I am somewhere here. So here's a ladder. I cannot use the ladder. inside there was a staircase maybe if I can get to the second floor uh, with the rubble here just climb the rubble the second floor there we go 
Uh, I'm kind of afraid these guys are gonna wake up. I'm gonna hold my weapon down in case he's friendly. How oh, could help him? He went to the roof. Did he die? This is him. I think it's him. Can I copy the radio? I cannot use the radio. It's kicking the door with the weapon down. I check what is it up down here. Just the block. Coming here. I surrender. Did I kill him? Looks like I won't be learning anything about the water from the driver now. I should at least try and use the key. I didn't want to kill him. Can I quick load? I mean, I didn't want to knock him down. There was only two options. What weapon is that? Oh no. Do I have to leave one of my weapons to use? Them? I didn't want to knock him down. So would this be a useful weapon? This would be my close range weapon. Then I have this pistol. I don't know what to do with the weapon. I definitely don't want to get rid of this because this is my main rifle. This, I don't think I even can get rid of this. So only option is to switch between the revolver and and this shotgun. Honestly, I think the sh uh, revolver is better than this. Come on, come at me, I want to test this weapon.
Tackling heute. Well, it's pretty effective close range. One shot, one kill. Oh, that was a kill. Okay, now let's compare it to this one. This one. It's a one shot kill as well, and I can use it on a long range. But it's much better weapon. Alright, let's go. Shotgun would have been good here. out? No? Come out then! <laughs> so, there's probably no chance to have a chat with the owners of this car. What a shame they're so silent. Though, had I had a car like this, I wouldn't want to give it up either. <laughs> in my book, driving beats walking in this heat any day. <laughs> Which reminds me, you've got a good test drive opportunity. While you were playing in this sandbox, I found some antennas. And the communication center should have them. Uh, uh, I think it's at that lighthouse, so you should head there. The lighthouse is so huge, we can't miss it. I have to stay and keep tabs on the area for a while, but once I'm done, I might join you there. See ya! Alright, I think uh, we're gonna take the car, I guess. Alright, check the weapons. Should I make that silent? This one? Maybe not. Just keep the damage at the maximum. Let the break space to exit. Listen up, everyone! The Baron is about to speak! Listen up, everyone! The Baron is speaking! Gentlemen, I received news of some traveling gang on a train invading our territory. This is unusual, since as far as I remember, we did a pretty good job of teaching the neighbors that actions like this end up costing them. These newcomers seem slow on the uptake. Or not from the neighborhood. In any case, we should find out who they are and what they want. I have called the people that I need separately. The rest of you are to ready your cars, guns, and combat train slaves. It might all be needed soon. As you were, everyone, the Baron has spoken. 
It's like a boat, so this used to be water. to go all the way to the lighthouse. Uh, what does it say here? Apparently to complicate this bunker is somewhere on the island next to the lighthouse. I need to find the entrance to the complex. Let's keep moving with, with the car. Interesting steering wheel. I kind of want to explore these um, boats over here. There's a crossroads. Let's ignore it. And what do we have here? See, it's like they're welding. There's another storm coming. Let's go see closer. Oh, there are some workers here. Safe. Maybe I can be friendly to them. Forgive me, a simple slave of holy flame, dumb slave. I know nothing at all. The slaves. These guys are slaves. I work, Mirza. See, Mirza, I work real good. I work real good, Mirza. Real good. Make the holy flame happy. Such good cable. Can't hack at all. Strong cable. It's too hard to hack. Yeah, there's another car. Is there a way up here? Long time hack. A good morning hack. Why you, Mirza? I, I know not you at all. You come check on us, yes? From Baron come from tower, yes? Forgive me, sir. I stupid slave. No, nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing. Master up there, yes. Master no all. Yes. Okay. These people are like... They're just slaves, but there's nobody... ...managing them. You are great. You control universe. You give all life. You make master. Why you are? What here do? 
Who let? Master, no expect you. Go away. No go there. Oh, lady, you can't. Holy flame will punish. You know, listen. Do how you want. Master will teach you. He will, yes. All right, let's go in here. You damn bitch! Can I talk to this guy? What's the shadow? Fuck! Cut! Okay, let's try to load and see. Because um, I kind of want to just talk to them. But let's see if we really have to like, fight our way. When sneaking around, the best path is not always obvious. Look for ladders. Looks for skull marks on your map. Okay. Weapon upgrades. What if I keep my work down? This is not Some fool runs off in the desert, he'll be back with his tongue out like a filthy dog. Begging to let him be for a cup of water. <laughs> or the hunter bring him. You're so negative, you make me want to puke. Puke? No, that's an idea. Fuck you! What? There's some kind of uh, machine gun. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. Smart weapon. So what ammo is this using? The same ammo as my rifle. <laughs> I kind of wanna test this. What should I do? Let's let's take a look at the weapon. This one. It's 
spring magazine mechanism. Seventy-five rounds. It's like a machine gun. Okay. Drive spring slowly loses tension over time. Can I like recharge the tension? Oh, I can recharge it like that. I kind of feel like keeping this weapon. But yeah, then it kind of needs to replace this weapon. Because I also need like a sniper type of weapon. And this one uses different ammo. Should I take it? I think I will take it. It's gonna be my close range, like crazy weapon. For now. Inside, it's darker here. And what weapon is this? We have to take a look at that. What ammo does this use? Super long barrel, light vision scope, reflex lock, no magazine. What? What weapon is this? Has so many gadgets to this one. I only have three ammo, like this is a spe this is a sniper rifle maybe. Sixth ammo. So if I need a sniper rifle maybe this is better than that one. But I do have iron sights. <laughs> Night vision scope. Oh, I didn't switch it. I don't know man, should I use this weapon? It seems like a dedicated sniper rifle. The night vision scope is useless. Maybe the reflex? Is 
This is a tough call because I don't want to leave this weapon behind. I already left one. I should Google it. What is the best weapon for me in this situation? Okay, 75,000. This is crazy. Okay, I'm just gonna quickly check our weapon guide so I don't make a mistake right here. Okay, I'm quickly reading the weapon guide. I don't want to ruin my rest of the game by making a bad selection. Does it tell me what uh, the weapon names are? Does it tell the name up here? Valve, Tikar and Gatling. Okay. Valve is a sniper rifle. Basically your only option for truly long range combat in Metro Exodus. So it's definitely your best weapon for that. This is your only sniper rifle and it works as such. It has huge kickback and way slower fire rate, but obviously it's very much one shot, one kill sort of weapons. This is useful in certain situations, but in general there are better options for taking a weapon slot. Okay, it doesn't mention the Gatling at all. It says that Bulldog Rifle is really good and Kalas is good. So I don't know should I actually keep the, this uh, Sniper Rifle, especially when I don't have a proper scope for it. Definitely keep the best. Um. So when we, like if I'm inside, this weapon becomes useless. It's like a long range sniper. And if I'm like a sneaky person, then I don't really need that. I basically just need a scope for this T car. So the question is should I keep this sniper 
Or should I keep my pistol? Like this I can snipe much better than with the actual sniper. Okay, I'm gonna save and then I'm gonna take a couple of shots. Then I'm gonna load. This is the proper sniper. Okay, let's load. Mm, it's so tough. I think my best bet would be to keep the AK and get rid of the Gatling as well. Keep the AK and uh, the other one. I feel like the Gatling is just gonna waste ammo. Okay, we need to visit there. I'll check upstairs first. Can even go higher. We can sleep line down here. No, I cannot go higher. They, did they find the ones I knocked down? I hope they don't find the ones I knocked down. So, check this over here. I got an idea here. Remember that group Tolian was bragging about? The one he bragged was so good. Only Baron could ever have something like that. So, while he's having fun, I went and had a taste that, well, he was not shitting. Awesome shit, bro. Let's go have some together. You think he finished it all by himself anyways? <laughs> Stupid fuck. We could even tell him that it was not slave that stole. <laughs> so Tolkien killed the little bitch. I can still go back to my rifle if I want here. I wanna test the Gatling. I'll just keep the Gatling for now. It's gonna be my weapon if I need to kill many people close range if I need to take down single ones I will use T-car or this one for long range and this is for massive hope they don't suddenly come up with some other shit Let's just sneak out of here. I don't wanna take this class down. Oh, I need night vision. Okay. Actually, I can maybe take them down. Alarm! Enemy sighted! Alarm, boys! Alarm! The fucking slaves are revolting! <laughs> slaves are revolting. Okay. We just got caught. Stay in the dark. Nothing to fear. He's alone. He's scared. He's weak. Somebody here. Hiding elsewhere? I see. Let's find. 
him and be done with it, everyone. You can't see me almost. Luckily, he's not looking hard. They're both in the it's same room. Like you, you know? I need to knock this guy down, but I don't want to kill them. So we need to kind of sneak behind one of them. Knock him down. Then knock down this next one. You'd better come out now! Right here. I should have turned the lights off from this room. Okay. Okay, there are three of them. Go so, here. I see him! Fuck, I need to kill him. This is crazy weapon. Okay, unfortunately I had to fight them, kill them. Oh well. Slaves run away, I guess. You, you killed Master. No laugh now. Flame will punish you. Flame always punish him who hurt the Master. Drive this car. Pick up my own car. Okay, that's just scared of me. Can I turn the lights off? Keep it on. Or not? that okay this is cool
check from here. I can drive a little closer. Drive off road to the right. Get up there. Is there a road? Doesn't wait. It's the road on the right. I think I should take the road on the right. Get up there. Some water. Oh, flames. I don't think I can go up there. Wait, can I go from left? Can I go from here? Listen up everyone, the Baron is about to speak. Listen up everyone, the Baron is speaking. Can I get to the lighthouse from down here? I help. No move now. And it burns. He's the here. Whole body burns. <laughs> I just can't. <laughs> Fuck. 
have the med kits. Okay, quick lot. Yeah, I forgot to make the med kits. I don't know if we can I can make them without that uh, desk. Medkit, I can craft them. Yeah, I know. Okay. I'm bloody tired of checking every corner. And we could blow up here like nobody's business. Plus, all the traps seem sprung already, anyways. Huh? Hey, who's that? It's the enemy! Keep that boy! I don't know if this is useful. Should I switch? Yeah, I think I should use this. <coughs> if I still have the attachments for it. Rather keep this. And this makes more sense to have a, a proper rifle, not the Gatling gun. Oh, this is a trap. What? It's a dead end? Came all the way here for nothing?
Dog. Yes, we kill all of those dogs, then drink some tea. Is everything quiet? Are they all dead? Come up here then. Oh, what weapon is this? Oh, we have to try that. What? Bulldog. So this is the better weapon, I think. Okay, uh... Iron sights, enemy scope. Yeah, let's keep the bulldog. Uh, switch. It uses the same ammo as this one, so we're gonna do this. Take all my extensions from that weapon. That's the old one. And bulldog, but I don't have a site for this. Even better grip, even longer barrel, reflex sides. Oh, this uses the same stuff as the other. The stab stability. Wow, this is a good weapon. Don't okay, leave any enemies out here. I get a bunch of them around here. Wrong button. Just somebody alive still. There is some ammo here. Maybe. Go see that guy who is shouting over there. Sure, he doesn't uh, catch uh, I kill you now. I'm not gonna kill him. Uh, you enemy? <laughs> oh, that was a bad choice, I think.
I think I shouldn't have knocked him down. Should have left him, uh, left him alive. My friend, the Moon Eye by Lair, as we call them, turned my people into slaves. Wanted to put me in shackles, too. <laughs> Better death. Oh, I thought she was old man. Old woman, I mean. Read you loud and clear. Your man helped me. I mean, you're dead. But why are you here? For five years, nobody would come here save for Moon Eye by Lair. Q, what do you know of the antennas near your lighthouse? There used to be a comm center before the war. My mother worked there. She was an officer. The facility is long abandoned. I went there after war to look for mom's traces, but found nothing. Abandoned? Q, we helped you. So could you help us in return? Leaving our man inside. Good. I will help. Are you? You have to find the archive. It should be near the command center. Look for shots taken after the war, starting with the year 2013. The Mir will soon be there. You can count on him. Miller, over and out. If we go, we better go now, before more of them arrive. Use the workbench if you need to fix something. There are all kinds of danger. A smart man wouldn't go there. You seem smart, but you do not have a choice. Alright, so... <coughs> it's the sniper rifle ammo. That's new. Incendiary am ammunition. <coughs> it uses a lot of... Uh, Crafting cost. A lot of this. How much does this? Just 20. But this ammo is really good, so. Maybe we make um, as much as we can. Got 5 of these. 120. Should be good there. We have to clean the weapons. <laughs> Repair the glass mask. This is good. Clean the weapon. Oh, it costs. We cannot clean the weapon because I wasted all my stuff make this what's the condition of the weapons oh they are almost good Okay, we are... Uh, wait, what? Red lights are actually increased the uh, accuracy. <coughs> Does it do the same here? Yeah, 
Yeah, it actually increases accuracy over here. This one doesn't have one. <coughs> so let's use the red laser. Hopefully it doesn't give out the uh, position. Should be good. Compass always shows the direction you should be heading. So over here. Okay, where did she go? She's over ready? There. No. Make haste then. We don't have much time. Before war, this place was beautiful. See, I was five then. My mom was young, alive. Now it's just desert. All the beasts changed into freaks. And people became beasts. My people became chattel. Not by themselves. The oil dogs made them. The oil stayed even though the sea dried out. Old people died. Only the young remained. And they all obey their masters now. The Munai by Lair say they're gods of fire now. And the young believe. Five years after the war, my mother died. I was all alone. I shouldn't have killed him. I know how to open the door, so I've been there. But I never went deep. There are spiders. <laughs> See the passage? You go through, I'll follow. Familiar from the old metro. The power's long gone. We need to turn it on to open the gate. The door won't open till we get the power on. Okay, let's get the power on. Someone must keep the power 
somewhere on the HQ level there should be a satellite images archive. I need to find the freshest ones taken after the war starting in 13. All right, let's go. If you see Mom's picture, bring it. I'll be thankful to you as long as I live. All right, keep that in mind. Find the picture. Kind of uh, wish I had the Gatling gun now. Hopefully this is a good weapon still. Fuck. She said to the left, small passage. Let's take the passage. Here, left, here. They don't like the light. So I'll make sure to keep the bit charged all the time. Can I run and jump? Like a running jump. Nope. Oh, I can make a running jump. Check downstairs. There's something down here. mask <coughs> okay, 
better to turn on light, all the lights. Turn the, all of the lights somehow. <laughs> like it would be nice to be able to turn on the lights in the whole building. Brighter. It's like electricity everywhere. It would be nice to read all the notes, but it would take so much time and I just don't want to use so much time to go through this. remember to repair the weapons whenever I get a chance. The spider home. I bet some spiders will come out of that later. Do I still need this? Yeah, I do. <laughs> Not 
another spider hole. That's the picture, maybe. That's the pictures we wanted. Okay, ventilation. Do I have to go to that hall? Over here. Is, wait a minute, is this the same room? No, that's a different room. I don't think I can get in here. Doesn't look like the ventilation, that's more like
this is the ventilation. Which way? The compass says here. Let me go here. We are switching to emergency supply. Should be enough for the list. If you already have the map, just wait for your eyes. I'm gonna open that yet. Now, when we finally have the data on all of the largest city agglomerations, it is obvious that our hopes to find one that had somehow been spared attack were unfounded. Moscow was apparently hit especially hard. The new data confirms that fallout makes it completely impossible to leave the island. Only Nova Fubiters might be marginally worse. Where Mommy! Look at what I drew! Oh, hey, who is this? It's me! I drew this! Look! That's a great picture! Senior researcher Takimova, please, take the child outside. This is a briefing, uh, after all. Come, Gyuru. You can't come in here. Come! Show me the picture else. While we're waiting, I suggest we take a look at the enemy territory. Here and here. This is, obviously, city lights. If not for Directive 01. If we had any means of communication, we'd have to report the coordinates immediately as a target for the follow-up strikes. That's interesting. Is this where I'm supposed to continue? Actually, no. So I think I will open that. I will check this first. Get the pictures. Everything's empty. Got it. The radiation maps. Nice. I 
have the maps, the communication center was functional for several several years after the war, so these maps may have all the information we need. We must return to the base and study them carefully. It's our best chance of finding some intact areas. That's cool. So now we can open that door. Right. He killed the lights. to repair the stuff. There they come. Time to switch back on. Where do I need to go? I'm gonna die soon. I don't know where to go, dude. Oh, do I need to do the lights? Come here! Power's failing! We'll be in the dark again soon! Hush, shaitan! Artyom! Gul! Let's get out of here! They won't jump us with lights still on! Go, go, go! <laughs> Really? They don't jump us? to take them back to the colonel. By the way, I, I brought your car. It's at the dock. 
It's amazing the lift still works with all the cracks in the bunker. Mother told me they had to repair many times and other things too. Thank you, Artyom. This is for you. Father gave it to me when I was little. Damir says there's a little girl on your train. Give it to her. May it bring her luck. You people are lucky. Most of the Munai Baile are raiding all their best troops. If they were all here, you'd be dead already. But now, we have a chance to change things. Ah, uh, Munai Bailer translates to something like oil rich people. Oil drillers, I guess. Listen to me. I'll tell you where to go now. When outside, go right. The road there used to lead to the sea, to port. Anna should be around there. Contact her. She probably found something interesting. <laughs> I'll stay and try to find out more about these oil drillers. We'll contact the base as soon as I get any useful information. Tell me, Yule, how did this Baron come to power here? My well, see ya, Artyom. Good luck. What? Bye, Artyom. Become slaves of their own will? There's like a question mark next to me. The left must be that.
There's a question mark on the left, so I will drive over there. Sir. I'll show you some things. <coughs> this dust will be the end of me. Look at my lair here. Didn't have such luxury back in Moscow. Still, this place is too hot. I feel I'm coming down soon, like Stepan. In any case, here's what I learned. See that crane at the dock? There is someone in the cabin. Can't see him that well, but I think he noticed me as soon as I arrived. That seems like a great spot to keep tabs on our base, so you should check it out. Look at that cracked ship now. The largest one, closest to the water. See? Well, it's not cracked, but rather carefully dismantled. I saw trucks carrying cages arrive at that boat. Looks like this is where the bandits keep their prisoners. There's that building over there, past the port. Looks like an air control tower, but I'm not sure. In any case, there should be a lot of equipment there. Something might come in handy. Oh, air control I see you tower. got the maps. You and Tamir did a great job there. <coughs> I'll keep watching the rigs, and you can choose your next goal. I wish I could wash off all this sand already. I hope we get out of this desert soon. If you're going to the port, there's a convenient zip line on the roof. All right, so maybe I leave the car here. I investigate all the areas. I investigate this. Port first, then I investigate. Jam. Oh, there's so many places to investigate. Where's the zip line? Yeah, that's gonna take me to the crane. I check that first and then the ship and then I come back and check the other ones. Wait, there's a zip line over there. There's a zip line over here. Can I maintain my weapons maybe? So. Be careful out there, all right? Oh, zip line comes from the crane to here. And it goes from here. There. So maybe I'll just go over to here. <coughs> so I'll go first here, then I check the crane, then I check the boat. And our train is here. Our train is over here. Behind this mountain. All right, let's go. Or how long have I been streaming? Three hours. Maybe I should stop now and continue tomorrow. Yeah, I'm actually gonna do that. 
I'm gonna stop for today. It's three hours into the stream now. Three and a half. So I will stop now. Continue tomorrow. Check these areas. See where it goes. So thank you for watching and I will see you next time probably tomorrow.